if you look at uh, look at our companies, uh, Wheels India has been making steel wheels for the European market from the early 2000s, aluminium wheels for the last 15 years. So we already have customers. So one is to reconnect to the existing customers on the wheel front. Second is to look show multiple products. It's important when you participate in these shows to be consistent and to be looking at uh, participating in it on a continuous basis. So we have followed up on, on last year, which is the first time we showed as a TSF group. I think what's important here is that we are committed to the European market. As a group, we would like to have products that we develop, especially for the European market, to service the end customer and give a superior value to him through our products and the combinations of products that we have. Especially in Europe, you have a lot of companies, including our competitors, who keep innovating. And uh, so when we come to shows, we would have matched up with what they probably had shown last time. But they, there are advances that happen all the time. Sometimes people show the product in advance of actually having a production sample, produ productionized item. But it gives an idea where, where the competition is going. Uh, I would not say that we are way behind, but uh, we are able to service some segments of the market better than they can, which are lower volume but probably higher value for us. So, as we are seeing, the world is more moving to digital. So we are having our digital tipping solution, DTS, available on the stand. Of course, our core product, you see over here our telescopic cylinder. This is still the core product of HIVA. Further, we have here on the stand, we have our truck and trailer accessories, fifth views, couplings. So yeah, we know that if India is a developing country. So in terms of products, let's say it's, it's a little bit following other markets. So it's always interesting for Indian customers to come here to the expo, to see what other bodybuilders are doing, what other OEMs are doing, what we are doing. And that one step by step we can bring into India. So if customers need any help with that, we have newer technology. We can help them ahead, like the DTS, like cylinders, we have from the smallest range from 93 over here till the bigger range of 226 mm. So the whole range we have for the customer. Truck and trailer, we have fifth wheels, we have couplings. So we can advise the customer what are the best. And in India, we make as well the tippers. And as we are making tippers as well as designing cylinders, we can offer the customer the best solution. We are a one-stop shop, we have the whole solution for them. So not only the cylinder or not only body, now we can offer the complete package. This is what we're saying to our customers. We're here for you to support, not selling only products, but selling our know-how. And we want to support with all the knowledge that we have gathered 40 years. And what's funny and what's beautiful is about those people who are coming from India to visit us here, from Europe to visit us here. So it shows that we are multi-continental. I am very surprised that Europe is so behind with this idea of entering Indian market. Really, very surprised. We should be doing that many years ago because India is the biggest and the most growing market in the world. And if you're not entering there, that means you're not going to exist in the future. We're strong in Europe, but we decided in 2022 to move to India, to open the headquarters there. Production, why production? Because it makes no sense just to sell. We want to be there, exist there and sell from there, but also produce from there. We want to show this year that we are a multicultural company. We want to show that we exist in the world. We're in Asia, we're in Europe, and we're bringing the same high quality product to our customers. So we are here at uh, uh, IAA to present our um, new products in electrification like this uh, 
E-axle, the E-Gen Power that we have behind there. This one is the one for 10-ton uh, axle uh, weight. It's uh, uh, an electric axle with uh, electric motor, transmission, brakes, everything integrated in, uh, in uh, one unit. Yeah, so uh, uh, it's been a, a period of a good period for Allison transmission, and like it's been a good period for the the trucks and bus industry in general the past couple of years. And uh, yeah, now it's uh, we we expect to follow uh, the, the the trends of the market uh, in our uh, vocations. We see that we will maintain uh, our position. It looks it looks. Uh, like uh, the feedback from the market uh, re uh, shows that uh, uh, the customer satisfaction with our products uh, is, a, is a good indication for that. It's always very important to have such show wear all people from the same industry can come together, exchange, meet, you know, challenge ideas and so on, more or less define the future because this is really in those area where you can meet people, not only from the industry, but also politicians, journalists, and so to, to share ideas and it's very, very efficient. We are Finia. Finia is a brand new company, one year old, but with hundred years of experience. Because we are coming from formal Delphi, I think it's quite well known as a brand. And as you can see here, we are displaying a lot of uh, product for internal combustion engine. We are really convinced that internal combustion engine has a bright future. Of course, we'll have different types of uh, technologies, electrification for mobility, we'll have some still diesel for very, very difficult uh, segment of mobility. But we have also new uh, evolution in uh, our portfolio. For example, you can see some engines here where we have derived from gasoline to diesel to change from you know, mechanical component to common rail. And this is done with simple and cheap components. So we can help to decarbonize with old fashioned uh, product, modify and optimize for, for the future. So basically, uh, we are for the first time here in IAA, uh, and basically here we are displaying mostly HCV products, truck products, trucks and trailer products. So uh, you know there are quite a new technologies that we have displayed here, which are few of them are EV uh, technologies. So uh, what I believe is at this point of time, European market is uh, slow. But we have been adding products in the European markets at uh, a very good pace. So for us, it has not been slow. We see a huge potential with the European market. As we are indigenized company, so uh, the cost advantages are of course there along with the techno technological advantages. And we believe uh, there is a lot of potential where the European customers are looking for the substitute of uh, Chinese uh, manufacturers. So Indian uh, manufacturers has a huge uh, opportunity in the area where everybody is looking for an option B uh, than a particular country. So that is where the opportunity lies uh, for us and we believe that we'll try and capture as much as possible.